because my next dish where I'm actually using this is not going to be made until the following day. So this is actually what I call food prep. Here's my other papaya, piece of papaya. Same thing, make sure seeds are out, take off the skin. And then, chop it up. And for this part, it's going in the bullet. I saved the bulk of my jalapeno just for this. Gonna get the seeds out. it nice and fine now I'm gonna need onions but I'm gonna switch to yellow onions Dice on this doesn't have to be too pretty or too organized. Next, I have garlic. Whenever I cut garlic, I first press it. Take the back of the knife, press it down. That's going to get the juices flowing. Give it a nice cut. Press it again, then add it to your dish. Two types of onions, now I have my red onion. And then, of course, I'm going to add some more papaya because that's the highlight of the dish. Get rid of the seeds first, of course.
So if you have not predicted as yet, we are going to blend this baby. But not before I add just a little bit of seasoning. And that could be all up to your liking. It's one of those things that you're going to taste or season to taste. All right. So I got some chicken stock. That's going to be the liquid that helps it blend. Okay, I'll start light. And then I could always add more liquid. So much I could do with this. Mm. This is it. This is it. All right, so stay tuned. I'm actually going to put it together in a dish. I have my puree, that which doubles as a sauce. I have my fresh papaya salsa as well that could be a great topping depending on what i'm gonna make 